None, or should I say, none will escape the truth behind The Conjuring, dare to delve deeper. The Conjuring isn't just a Hollywood scarefest. It's based on the terrifying true story of the Perron family, a tale that has haunted many for decades. In the 1970s, the Perron family moved into an old farmhouse in Rhode Island, unaware of its dark past. The house built in the 18th century had a long history of mysterious deaths and tragedies, a legacy of sorrow that seemed to linger in its very walls. Almost immediately, eerie things started happening. Objects moved on their own, whispers echoed through empty rooms, and the family felt an unshakable sense of dread. It was as if the house itself was alive, watching and waiting. Enter Ed and Lorraine Warren, the famed paranormal investigators. They claim the house was haunted by Bathsheba Sherman, a witch who lived there in the 1800s. The Warrens believed Bathsheba had cursed the land and her malevolent spirit was tormenting the parents. The Warrens conducted a seance and things took a sinister turn. According to them, Bathsheba's spirit attacked Carolyn Perron, leaving her with lasting scars. The seance was a harrowing experience, one that the family would never forget. The Perron family reported numerous other terrifying experiences, including apparitions and physical attacks. The Warrens documented their findings extensively, adding credibility to the chilling tales. Their accounts have been scrutinized and debated, but the fear they felt was undeniably real. The house itself has a storied past. Before the Perrons, it was home to several families, many of whom experienced their own share of misfortune. There were reports of suicides, drownings, and even a murder. The land seemed cursed, a magnet for tragedy. Diaries and notes from previous occupants detail strange occurrences. Footsteps in the attic, ghostly figures in the hallways, and an overwhelming sense of being watched. These accounts paint a picture of a house steeped in paranormal activity long before the Perrons arrived. One of the most notable events was the appearance of a ghostly figure believed to be Bathsheba herself. Witnesses described her as a dark, shadowy presence, often seen lurking in the corners of rooms or at the foot of beds. So next time you watch The Conjuring, remember, sometimes real life is scarier than fiction. The horrors faced by the Perron family serve as a grim reminder that some stories are deeply rooted in reality, no matter how unbelievable they may seem.